Hi everyone. I am back y'all with another reading guys. This is going to be for Taurus um, for the month of April. I'm a little, a lot behind with the, um, the monthly reads on the channel. It's because I've been having a lot of personal readings and not that I'm like pushing you guys to the side, but it's just trying to balance everything out. As well guys, I uh, have a website with products that I'm running as well too. So I'm still keeping everything in rotation, guys. I'm just getting a, trying to get a flow of everything. All right, so let's see what messages we got for the Taurus. Oh yeah, yeah, really quick guys. I wanna show you guys um, my product that is getting ready to be presented on the website, guys. I have a lot of people who's been asking about the energy clearing spray. Okay, so this spray, guys, is for people who don't want to burn sage or when you're in the car or when you're in your office and you know you really can't light up and burn a sage or a Palo Santo stick, right? We have the energy clearing spray, all right? So you just simply, in between readings, because I know there's a lot of people who read tarot as well, okay? In between doing your workings, okay? When you're in the office, in the car, and somebody's around you with sticky, nasty energy, just like that. And it has an amazing smell, guys. It smells, it has like a, a lemony scent, okay? Because it does have Florida water in it. Um, it has a lot of things that people would use to cleanse already meshed into one and made into an energy clearing spray all right so i just want to let you guys know about that product it is going to be available really really soon on the website so i just wanted to give you guys a little heads up okay so now we can jump into the read all right so this is going to be for taurus Taurus, Taurus, the bulls. All right, let's get a message for the month of April going into uh, May. All right, because we're at we're pretty much in the middle of April. So we'll do this for now until the end of April going into May. All right, so let's talk, guys. Let's talk. Let's see what messages we got. This is going to be for my bulls. Please give me a message for my Taurus. This is a general read, guys, so it may or may not resonate. Take what applies and leave what doesn't. For my cross watchers, yeah, the, you can pick and, you know, what parts you guys are playing in this, okay? Because I know cross watchers, they be watching they, they people readings. <laughs> All right. Taurus, give me a message for Taurus, please. All right, we got the Ace of Wands here at the bottom of the deck, and we got the Eight of Cups. Ooh, Four of Wands. All right. Ooh, the Justice card. For some of you, there is like somebody's moving out, somebody's leaving. There could be like, um, a marriage involved but i'm getting that somebody you guys could be walking away to start something fresh this could be like moving into a new home um something like that but i'm getting like somebody's walking away for something new yeah didn't i tell you we got the world card a cycle has completed itself okay so there is an ending here there is an ending and you could be a little overthinking it or worried about it okay there's the new the new energy all right, so you're closing a chapter and you're moving on to something new. There was something traumatic or dramatic that has happened. Somebody is, yeah, like there's a tower moment and then the chapter closes and then there's a beginning, a new beginning. Seven of Wands, okay? You had to defend yourself, stand up for yourself. Then we got the lovers. Could be dealing with a Gemini. Wow. Five of Swords. Okay, so there needs to be a close number chapter on some type of pettiness, cattiness, some type of issue. Somebody got some issues here. So maybe there was a disagreement. Okay, there was a disagreement here. The Magician. 
the Ten of Swords and the Six of Wands. It looks like you guys are coming out victorious out of all of this, okay? So there could be an issue, and it looks like you are victorious, okay? So let's get a little bit more. Tell me more about this world. Ooh, so there's some something going on on the internet. There's something going on on the internet. The world and the Page of Swords is definitely internet. Um, so you're surprised by this information okay we got the empress the empress this is mother energy this is wife energy this is a growth and abundance this is possibly even a pregnancy okay there's some shocking news oh yeah something came out the moon something was revealed something was revealed possibly on the internet tell me more yes something's crazy like it's like some information came to you like something was revealed okay and somebody here this is causing some confusion wow wow there's some confusion why is the nine of swords here yeah this news is like what are you kidding me are you serious are you serious like it was shocking shocking news tell me more about this eight of wands Wow, you're not even sure what to do with this information. Wow, tell me more about the Eight of Wands. Page of Cups, didn't I tell you? The Devil and the Hermit and the Ace of Swords, High Priestess. The Devil here could be dealing with the Capricorn or a Virgo here with the Hermit. But it's like you're you're researching something. You're research, researching something. You are looking for clues or looking for some type of evidence about this news that just came out. Why is the Ace of Cups here? Temperance. Wow. Ace of Cups and Temperance. Could be dealing with the Sagittarius, but... The Ace of Cups is a new beginning. A new beginning. Temperance is balance. Queen of Pentacles, you guys, is energy. Why is the tower here? What happened? The Hermit. Yes, yeah, like I'm saying, like, maybe you've been off the scene a little MIA. But you just found out some shocking news. It's, it's something that's like, what? Like, really, like, the news is, like, unbelievable. I'm getting, I can't believe it. Someone's father could be involved. The emperor and a ten of pentacles. This could be someone's, someone in your family. The emperor is father energy, husband energy, but as well, this is, like, a brother or an uncle or somebody that's older. This Ten of Pentacles makes me feel like this could be someone in regarding to family. Um, but yeah, see, we got the High Priestess and the Ace of Swords. Like, your intuition is telling you that this could be true. This That this news that you got could be true. Somebody is talking about defending themselves. Okay? It's about defending themselves. Like... This news that you're getting is involving someone feeling like they needed to defend themselves, okay? The lovers and the four of pentacles can be dealing with the Gemini. Yeah, I'm getting like the lovers is a decision in love. So for some of you... There's possibly a decision in love. Um, and I feel like you're holding back here because I feel like you want to try something new. You want to take a new approach. Three of Swords and a Three of Cups. Okay, like what's going on? Is there a third party involved here? Why is the Five of Swords here? Yeah, you're disappointed. Ugh, this news is disappointing. This is very disappointing news.
dang, it's like you fear that this is the end of something. Like you feeling like this is the end to a, to something. Like this is somebody's ending. Six of Cups. It talks about the past. This also talks about like younger children. Yeah, see, it's like something's not the same. It's, in your hopes and fears section, it's like this. It, things won't be the same. It won't be the same, okay? Like this is memories. It's like the good days. Like the good old days, like, you know. But with the Ten of Swords, there's like, it ain't even like that no more. And like I said, yeah, see the Empress and the Ten of Pentacles. This, I keep getting, we got the Emperor and the Ten of Pentacles and the Empress and the Ten of Pentacles. So this could be involving, like I said, a family. Or there's a marriage or something like that here. And the Six of Wands, that's the outcome. We got the Hierophant. You guys, this energy. Okay, um, tell me more about the Hierophant. Queen of Cups, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. This situation could be track, could be tracking a lot of attention. Okay, um, I feel like you feel some type of way about it. Um, This could be like a karmic situation. Somebody could be dealing with the law, with the justice card here. You could be dealing with the Libra. But I'm getting like with the nine of wands there. This is like just being cautious. Um, why is the justice card here? Two of wands. Yeah, it's like what goes around comes around type energy. I'm getting like maybe you're asking around. Maybe somebody, you're, I feel like some of y'all are asking around, like getting information about this situation. I'm getting like somebody feels ashamed or guilty. Somebody was being sneaky or there was some like sneaky stuff going on. Okay. Yeah, see, I feel like you're... A little confused by the situation you don't have all the details but i feel like you're going to be getting the details with the ace of swords like you're i feel like you're looking for you know what actually happened what's the tea what's the story and it's all over the internet it's over it's on the internet or it's something that you're viewing that's like what are you kidding me the devil and the strength card somebody has real strong uh kind of funny energy here Okay, and I keep saying that it could possibly be a family member. Okay, family or someone who's married or married into the family or something like that. The Queen of Wands could be a Leo, Sagittarius, Aries. The Queen of Swords, Libra, Gemini, or Aquarius. But I'm getting that some news that was in the, something that was in the dark is coming to the light here. So what's done in the dark is definitely coming to the light. I feel like there's some, some news being headed, headed your way. There's some news that's headed your way. Um, I don't feel like it's directly like involving you. I think it's somebody that you know or somebody that could be close or somebody that's in the, in the same circle as you or somebody that you, you know, just could have rubbed elbows with. But the news is still kind of like, what? 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 So you guys let me know what's going on in the comment section below, okay? I'm going to chat with you later. Like, share with your family and your friends. Um, and if you're new to the channel, go ahead and click the bell to subscribe. We would love to have you here, all right? So till, until next time, guys. Ciao for now.